So Chow Chin Chow's Lantern Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Detective Pikachu Let's Play. In the last episode, we arrived here at the Litwick Cave and, well, it, everything didn't seem as it seemed because the fact is this Galele here wasn't willing to help. It was wanting to ha hurt and maim people and not really help. So uh, we've been able to sway it to help us again and it's okay now but i don't know we'll see anyway glaley's about to use ice beam all right we counted on you glaley glaley whoa Ugh. you okay you better get some rest uh, by the looks of it thank you glaley take it easy for a while glaley now, we should be able to cross. Take care and don't you slip. Alright. Can I talk to you? Okay, you're fine. You don't need to talk. I don't need to talk to you. Hey, Tim. Tim. What do you want? I'm the great detective Pikachu! Pikachu! Oh, there's an echo. <laughs> Tim, go ahead and shout something too. It's really fun. No. I mean, I could, but I won't. You're telling me to take it easy on the ice, and yet you won't do it, Pikachu. Take it easy on the ice, okay? Okay, so what are we looking at here? There's a breeze. Here, the wind is blowing out of this small hole. Oh. This is not, uh, this is nice. If we can break down the wall and make it bigger, well, and make the hole bigger, I bet we'd have a chance of a strong wind. Break down? You mean this rock? Yeah. Tell me how we could do uh, that. Do it. Um, make a tool to dig with. How about making a tool? I see. What kind of tool? Uh, since uh, we're digging, maybe a shovel? We're going to have to uh, uh, make it here. Do you think we'd be able to find the materials to make a shovel? Oh, good point. Uh, you're really keeping an eye on your surroundings, aren't you, Pikachu? Of course I am. I'm the great detective Pikachu. There's only one thing we can make uh, with, with what we want, that uh, we could find. What is it? A pickaxe. Uh... Dev team, Pokemon, um, you spell pickaxe with an E at the end? Just want to mention that. Pickaxe is spelt with an E at the end. Even I know that, and I'm dyslexic, so I can't spell. But I know you spell pickaxe with an E at the end. A pickaxe. A pickaxe? Do you really think we can make it? Would you be surprised... Uh, uh, think about it. What we need, well, um, well, keep in mind, only stuff that we find, we can only find stuff in this cave. What stuff do we need to grab, uh, to gather, to pick up a pickaxe, uh, to make a pickaxe? Well, it needs to have a part to dig with. Exactly. Something sharp and pointy well I'll keep my eyes peeled for anything that we need yeah and we need a handle uh, add something to uh, straight to uh, hold it with it shouldn't be too difficult uh, to fight uh, it shouldn't be too long too it should be long it should be long too uh, it would need more centrifugal force uh, to be easier to dig with. Okay, Pokemon, using big words and spelling pickaxe wrong. 
Well, is that how you spell pickaxe? I don't know. Okay, Google. Spell pickaxe. Pickaxe is spelled P-I-C-K-A-X-E. See? Even Google could spell it right. <laughs> I got it. Something long, straight, and easy to hold. Right. The last thing is something to tie this part together. A rope would be perfect. Okay, got it. We'll look for those three things. All right. Well, I think I have two. I think I have an idea for two of those things. Because here's a large pointy rock. This rock is pretty. Uh, it's uh, This rock is blue and very pretty. But I wonder how hard it is. It's a blue glowing gemstone. Small rock may be useful. Small stone. This must be a piece of rock that we drop... Uh, that we dropped. It's really pointy. Bet we could use it. Sharp rock. Uh, this sign. A broken sign. Maybe we could use it as a stick. Yeah, we can't use any of those rocks. Uh, do you have a rope? About materials for a pickaxe. I'm thinking we could uh, uh, we could widen the hole uh, in the uh, wall with, if we make a pickaxe. Wow! Talk about uh, imagination. I'm definitely uh, we wouldn't uh, thought of that. We're looking for parts. Do you have anything we could use? Like a I don't know a hair. Um, one of those hair clips? You know? Hmm. The only... I only bought my camcorder with me. Uh, maybe something uh, useful is lying around here. Right, I'll have a look. Um, I don't really know where I can find a rope. That's why I want. I need a rope. We're trying to make a pickaxe to widen the hole. Have you seen anything around that might be useful? Parts? You mean like a rock or something? Well, I need a rope now, actually. i got pretty much... I've got rocks. I've got a handle. I need some kind of rope. Um... Oh, let's see. How about my belt? Uh, I think I... I think it could be used as some kind of... Uh, used for some kind of loop instead of a rope. All right, as long as you keep your trousers on, that's fine. As long as you can keep your trousers on, that's perfectly fine. You know, PG channel and all. <gasps> Got a belt. Of course. I'm sorry to ask. It's thinner than my belt. <laughs> What's that saying there, Tim? <gasps> uh, it should work better. Thank you very much. Case note. Hey, what do you want, Pikachu? It's time to look at your case notes and think about this. I was just about to do that. I was just about to do that and you're now telling me I need to do that. Problem is, I don't have my stylus with me right now. So, this is going to be a train wreck. Hang on, let me get my work. Let me get one of my other styluses out. Right, I have my DSi here. I have my DSi here. That'll do. Hmm. I'd say it's probably about 50 feet or more to the exit. Yeah. Okay. Your point being... I need my stylus, so I'm using my 3D and my DSi stylus for this, because I don't know where my actual stylus is. I keep on losing the darn things. Right. So, I'm thinking a handle. Do you think that's right? Yeah. I do. Do you think that's right? There you go. That's nice. Your pickaxe is complete. With that, we can tear down this wall. Hopefully. 
Yay, my pickaxe is complete. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, and don't forget to give the belt back. I know. We got a pickaxe. Still spell pickaxe with an E, Pokemon. That's just going to be my thing, isn't it? It's just going to be, I'm just going to put the name of this title is going to be Pickaxe. Uh, I'm going to spell it right, and I'm going to get, uh, put three explanation marks into the fact that I, uh, I I still know how to spell this. Uh, I still know how to spell pickaxe, and I'm dyslexic, which means I can't spell read or write that well. But I'm pretty sure that I know how to spell pickaxe, which is more than the games does, apparently. Um. Okay. Nice. The wind is blowing through that hole now. That would have been cool to turn it into a mini game, you know. Game. You could have just turned it into a, uh, a game. You press A in time and stuff like that. But then again, I guess you're playing too much. You're doing too much of these quick time events. I don't need any more. Thank you very much, game. It looks like we'll be able to get through that hole now. Make it out of that hole. But we didn't find any clues uh, about my dad. Is that so? Don't don't you think it's awfully strange an instant like this would happen at all? You mean the there might be some kind of cause behind Glaley going berserk like that? I don't know for certain, but uh, there's uh, too many odd parts about uh, this whole thing. Anyways. We should think about getting out of here. Let's head to where Amelia is. Yeah. All right. I'm faster than you, Pikachu. You can't keep up, can you? Oh, look at this. Hey, hey Pikachu. It's what are you doing? Okay. Hurry up, or it's gonna leave. Oh, sorry. Oh, what's this? Huh? What? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Really, Pikachu? You know, you could have just told me you wanted to get up on my shoulders. <laughs> That's no fun. So, Triplet, we're counting on you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Going up. We made it out of the cave. It looks like we can get out uh, of through this atrium. A hole in the ceiling, by the way. That's an atrium. Uh, let's check the uh, check the Pokemon on the video. Drifloon should be able to help us look for it to carry us out. We should need a strong wind to pass by. We successfully carried out by Drifloon and escaped the cave. The next day, Pikachu invites me to the cafe. He said. It, he always goes to on the first floor of the building where his te uh, it, detective agency is. This is not the first floor. This is the ground floor. This is the ground floor. Finally, a British people huh? understand how this works. Right here. Hey, Pikachu. Oh, do you two work together at the agency? Um, no. My name's Tim Goodman. I'm Harry's son. And it's uh, nice to meet you. So you're Tim, huh? Yep. Well, I'm Pablo. Hi. Hi, Pablo. Ludicolo here is our waitress. Whoa. Oh, wait up. Come on, Ludicolo. You can't greet someone properly with coffee cups still on your head. <laughs> Isn't that a dangerous to use Ludicolo like that? It's a carefree waitress. I feel sorry for Ludicolo. So, any news about Harry? No, they still haven't found anything. Uh, well, that's Harry. <laughs> I'm sure he'll pop up unexpectedly someday. Yeah, I'm sure you're right. Here you are. Thank you, Pablo. Pikachu, need milk or sugar? Nah, no thanks. Mm, this coffee smells so good. Mm. He drinks it black. I couldn't do that. I need milk and sugar. Oh, you're right. Delicious. I know. Ah. <sighs> It has the best aroma, as well as pleasant acidity, along with the bitterness and balanced body. Once you drink this, you won't be able to go to other cafes. Mm. 
Maybe Costa could learn something, eh? You're liking that way. All right, so I guess we're in this cafe. No, not I'm not heading out. No, not heading out. I want to talk to the customers. Hmm. Uh, about the Pokemon instance. I'm trying to find uh, more information about the Pokemon instance. Uh, caused by the instance caused by Pokemon. I hear they're interested increasing. Is the report uh, uh, for school or something? You should watch GN New the GNN News. They always have a scoop on something. Maybe they we must have very good staff. GNN. That's the company Amelia works for. Um, uh, Hayat Cafe. Do you come to this cafe often? I do. I'm a fan of Pablo's music, but the coffee is really good here too. It, the original blend uh, is the best I hear. That uh, the second... F I hear that there's a detective agency on the second floor too. First floor. It's on the first floor. Uh, how mysterious. Uh, about Pablo. It's... So is Pablo famous? Hmm, in a way you could say that. People in the know know about him. People in the know know about him. Alright. Ooh, piano. That's Pablo's piano. He doesn't play it any much, uh, very much anymore, but uh, he lets young musicians perform uh, a few times a week. Oh, cool. Hello? Hello? I guess it's not turned on. Were you planning on singing? No, no, I just saw a mic and... <laughs> oh, Tim's like me. He just sees a mic and goes, What's the Chow Chin Chows? <laughs> no, what's to use it? A standard drink and a drink I've never seen before. That's the kind of selection I would expect from Pablo. Hey, Ludicolo. Ludicolo. Well, if it isn't uh, the girl everyone comes to see. You're uh, looking well today. Girl, is she? A girl? It's a she. Hey, Tim. Don't be rude. This is 2019. <laughs> Pablo said she was a waitress. <laughs> Yeah, it's 2019. People could be people with Pokemon could be whatever they want. It's 2019. So, about coffee. It's uh, was sweet. It's delicious as always. Moody. I'd love to say, I'd love to stay here and have another cup, but I got to my I gotta go. Can we talk to Pablo. The big, the Baker Detective Agency is on the first floor, above the cafe, right? Harry used to stop by a lot. I knew he had a son, but I didn't know you were, were so big. Harry looked young. My mum always called him immature. Haha, <laughs> that's a good one. Uh, about Harry. Where do you think my dad is now? Well, maybe somewhere he can smell the aroma of coffee. You're probably right. He's probably drinking a cup now. Did you come from the? Uh, did you come to the city for Harry? Yeah, I did actually. I see. I miss Harry too. I hope he's. Uh, you'll find him soon. About Ludi Cola. Ludicolo is the waitress, right? Yeah, I let her help out uh, just to see how she would do. And she really seemed to like it. Uh, she really seemed to like the work. All right. How about the Hi Hat Cafe? How's the cafe been? Um, in, uh, here, has the cafe been here a long time? Well, we just passed two years here. Uh, I used to play the piano. Were you a musician? Yeah, 
A long time ago now, though. Uh, about Pikachu. A Pikachu apparently likes coffee. The coffee blend at this cafe? I'm glad to hear it. The cafe is blend is uh, like the face of the business. All right. I think that's all we're getting out of you. Yeah, I'm heading out now. Well then, let's sell the tap. Thanks, that was delicious. Sure, come back soon. Well, let's head back home. Okay. Oh. Hey, oh, hello, Tim. Mr. Sir. Baker. More Pokemon incidents are going on. Be careful out there. Oh, uh, okay. Thank you. Yeah, thanks. Welcome, Mr. Baker. Huh. Hmm. Pikachu never used to drink coffee before the accident. Hmm. Interesting. Things are getting even more interesting. As I predicted, a strange incident occurred in the cave. Hmm. But we didn't find any clues about my dad. No. That's true. But this might be worth looking into. What is it? Well, I don't know exactly. Maybe a broken vial. But why would something like that be in a cave, you know? Wait a second. Look at the shape. Doesn't it look familiar? Hmm. See? You're right. The shapes are similar. Yeah, they are similar. Mm. If this is part of a vial, then pharmacies and hospitals might be suspect. Yeah. And also research facilities, too. Pikachu, even if we only checked hospitals, it'd take forever. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, do you know how many hospitals there would be in the Rhyme City area? Oh, hey, Tim. Can you do me a favor and mark down where Harry got into his accident? Sure. I think it was around here. This has been bothering me for a while now. Hear me out. The accident was someplace not even close to the marked areas on the map. So why does that matter? Well, try matching it up with the map of Rhyme City. Okay. Oh. Now you see what I mean? I think Harry had his accident on his way back from this place. Hmm. You could be right. We should investigate this place next. Alright, the PLC, Pokemon Research Lab. Would you like to continue playing? Um no, I would not. I think we've gone too f I think we've gone far enough actually. I think this is a great place I think this is a great place to stop because this is the end of chapter two. So you know what? I think this is a great place to stop. So we're gonna continue uh, we're gonna start chapter three in the next episode of our Detective Pikachu Let's Play. If you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more. But until next time, I am Lantern Joe. Mean to love Pokemon let uh sorry. <laughs> I got it in a middle there. Mean to love Pokemon get to Lazar. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night! Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And of course, you can ring the bell, and you'll be notified first when new videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter, at Lantern Joe, and you'll be able to get news about the channel, new videos, and so much more as well. And if you want to watch some more videos, there should be some in the top right and top left hand corner of this video. But until next time, from me, Joe, and from Lantern as well, we'll see you again.